Hey everyone, welcome to Princess of Gay, I'm your host Connie, and today we are here with episode 4 of Kid Cosmic. Uh, last time we searched out a spaceship, we dealt with some uh, demon alien dog things, <laughs> and uh, we're kind of just still setting some stuff up. We, we had the precognitive cat, I guess, joining the crew, <laughs> and setting up for future, like, war on, uh, in the desert and all. Gonna be interesting to see where this goes. Definitely gonna be an interesting ride, and I'm all for it. Uh, let's see where it goes. We're just gonna get right into this. Why waste any more time? When the screen fades to black, pause this redirect and go to the description below. Follow the link to the reaction, and after you watch it, come back here to the redirect and resume play. Because after fades black and then it fades back in, everything from that point forward will be my afterthoughts and will contain spoilers to the episode. So, that being said, thank you so much for tuning in, and I will see you at the reaction. And we are back, and we'll begin with spoilers in 3, 2, 1, now. So this episode was basically a documentary-style excuse me, series of incidents that uh kid and his his friends had to kind of go through just taking on all these different aliens um and seeing how they handled it all and we see that um all the others are having their times to shine they all like have their big moments from rosa just you know be being big and being able to take down a lot of enemies to Joe opening a giant portal to teleport them back to Earth after they've been kidnapped by um, some alien uh, people eaters <laughs> uh, who, who very much look like uh, xenomorphs. And, yeah. So, they are, uh, they're all doing their jobs all doing really well starting to get the hang of their powers except kid who's just not really getting a moment to shine so in the end papa g stages a robot invasion kid ends up winning uh saving the day and he gets his medal and everything he gets to have the moment of glory but it's very clear Chuck is going to use this against him and is going to reveal the truth that it was all just the G's uh, doing their thing. So, yeah. Uh, it, there's not much to this episode. It, it, this, this was very much like, okay, we got our group together. Now we're going to actually see them do shit. But it, it, it comes across more like a training montage of sorts, like them like really starting to get the groove of things, taking on these low-level enemies. And I, I think that's a smart idea. I like I like the one bounty hunter chick who's, who just comes in and it's like, I'll, I'll pay you 950 credits for, for, the, for the stones. And... <laughs> and they're like... Uh, Papa G's like... Two, two million or something like that. And she's like, oh, too rich for my blood. I'm out. <laughs> it's just like, all right. <laughs> um, Yeah, it, it was a pretty fun episode and was definitely about, like, showcasing them getting a hang of their powers and showing that kids taking a little more extra time. It's clear that Chuck is going to show him the tape or something. He's going to reveal this to Kid kid's going to get upset by this revelation and in the end the others are going to be put in danger where he's going to have to be the one to save the day and truly earn the medal i i i feel like it would be really weird for it to go any other way because that that's like how these tend to go that this kind of thing's been done plenty of times before and it's perfectly set up to do the same thing again. And there's nothing wrong with doing it like that. There's nothing wrong with uh, going with a formula. Formulas can work. And as long as it's entertaining and fun and enjoyable and 
believable that kid would be able to save the day here, then I have no issue with it. So, yeah. I I, I really do think that this was a good uh, episode. Again, there's just not too much to talk about with it. It's, it's a very simple episode. A very basic one. Um, and that's good for what it was. But just, it leaves these afterthoughts really really low. It doesn't give me a lot to talk about. Um, but tell me in the comments below, what did you think of this episode of Kid Cosmic? Let me know. And for now, I'm Connie and I'm signing off. See y'all next time.